battle. Um, obviously, a very good team, and, and you know, it was a very difficult game for us for 90 minutes. I thought we started excellent. You know, got the early goal, had some chances there, especially in the first half. And you know, for us, I, I think sometimes when you play these big matches, you, you get into, you know, you get a lead, and then you try to play to protect the lead and not make mistakes. And we kind of lost our way there for a little bit, and, and allowed them back in the game. And, you know, that's what good teams do, they come back at you and they tied it up. But like we've, we've shown all, you know, preseason, regular season up to this point, that this team can respond and we can gain game in the same minute. And we saw that in our goal. And then you see our mentality, our chemistry, and a lot of fight to us. And then we saw the game out without really giving up a dangerous chance there at the end. So really proud of the effort, the mentality. This team's coming together. Excited about what we're going to be able to do. Looking at uh, this week, you lay an egg today to carry over in, in Friday. How important was this? How nice was it to see the club win? And that's for all three of you guys. Um, we knew, like Coach said, that we can bring a lot of quality. And being number third of the country, we knew it would be about 50-50. And like Coach said, like the game was not perfect. We knew there would be moments they would have the ball. We stayed compact, we were smart and just pick our moments. We had two great moments, two goals, and that's how big teams play. Those big moments, we gotta be there. And two big goals, and it's a big game. Uh, this team I'm proud of this team. Yeah, I just think, you know, it's early, still early, and we're, we're still coming together, and, and we gotta just not be perfect. We gotta just focus on what we are right now, which is a very strong team. You know, mentally, you know, uh, togetherness is there, and, and we got to just find moments when we can bring out a game until we get until we get more of season form and grow together. And at the end of the day, we still have players in any moment. You know, you got both these guys in next to me. Any moment, they can make a play and win the game, and, and you saw that today. And, you know, I, I thought the first half we could have had a couple goals. You know, second half, obviously, when we needed it, we found a way to get get one in and make a great play and we'll grow from this and there's not going to be anything other than proud right now. Okay. I mean, we just stuck to what we've been doing throughout the whole pre season and throughout the beginning of the season we found ways to win games even if it wasn't pretty for about 90 minutes. I mean, if we just continue to stick to what we've been doing, how fast do you run for yard dash? Do you know? <laughs> um, if I could guess, I would say around four or four um, Yeah, you're pretty good. I don't know. He says he's faster. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> we haven't done the race yet, so we're, you know, I'll tell you what, I'm not beating either of them in the race. <laughs> Akron's always been built to do well at the end of the season. But facing adversity like we did today, how much will this season, this team, and get it ready for you know, the end of October? Yeah, that's, that's why you play the best teams. You gotta, you gotta find out how we gotta move forward and improve what may work. And Robert Morris, the team that sat back and, and you know wasn't trying to create problems for us, it's a different solution we may have needed to win the game. Here you're playing a team that's gonna fight you for the ball and has experience, was in the front of four. Their belief is there, and we may have to, you know, go through a struggling period to know that we're capable of just sticking together and, and playing through it, and, and you know, just holding on in the games until we can find our way again. And if you don't play these matches, and when you can't find that out, then it's too late. You know, the emotions get higher, more at stake. So this is the perfect time to do it. And it's always better to do it after win and learn from it and continue to grow confidence. Oh, we're gonna get better. Yeah, what did you find out about? It? yourself as a team today and how much can you use this as a building block moving forward? You need to be done. Yeah. What did you find what did you learn today about you guys as a team and how can you use it built moving forward? So I think until now we knew we were doing great because three wins and three games that's great. But like Pittsburgh today was like the biggest challenge we had this season. And I, I think we had a statement, we had to prove something today, and we just show the field what we are capable of. No matter if it's pre, like when we said, we got the win. And I think that was huge for the rest of the season because like our mentality right now, like, 
It's just about winning it. That's what we want for the rest of the season. Looking at Indiana, what problems do they pose? How important are these next couple of days leading up to that match? Uh, I mean, obviously Indiana's obviously a very good team, but I say we just continue to prepare how we've been preparing because if we just stick to what we've been doing, and when we play our best, I feel like maybe us can compete with us. So when we're at our best, I think that when we was a team, we'll finally be able to go. Yeah.